name is Maria de Souza. I am the founder of Posture Queen. This is a place for you to learn all things good posture and movement for a life without pain and a life lived with more elegance. Today I'm going to talk about handbags and the shoulders. Have you ever noticed people around you that have one shoulder lower than the other? That's very, very common. I have that as well. You might notice, you might note, not. I've been trying to fix that for the last few years, so you might um, not notice so much. So and I'm gonna tell you how I have been fixing it for myself. So the reason why we have a shoulder lower than the other is because of a repetitive pattern that is going on for many, many years. And that has to do the way we carry the weight. So, handbags, how do you carry the handbag? So, we tend to carry our handbag always on the same side, day in, day out. And year and after year and after year. And we also carry our shopping always on the same side. So it's no surprise that this shoulder starts moving down and this side of ourselves starts shrinking. So what we have to start doing and to pay attention is to the way we are carrying our handbags and the weight that we carry around. So we all have a predominant side. We are either right-handed or left-handed. And of course, we tend to use more of the predominant side. That's normal, that's what we do. But if we want to have a more balanced body and not create so many misalignments and imbalances in the body, we need to start paying attention to what we're doing um, to pay attention to those repetitive patterns. So we need to start using more of the known predominant side. But when it comes to your shoulders, and try to correct this pattern, all we have to do is to start carrying our weight um, in a different way. So, what I have been doing for the last few years. This is my one of my handbags. I love this kind of bags like this because I can carry, I can wear it in many ways. I can carry it in my elbow, in my hand, in my shoulder. So it's important that we vary. More important is that we change shoulder, that we don't always carry the bag on the same shoulder. But it also helps if we have different bags that allow us to carry it in different ways. That help us to come out of that repetitive pattern. So I wear it in my hand, I wear it in my elbow, I wear it in my shoulder. But I always remind myself to wear it on the side that um, is not the, the side that I always do. And then I have different bags like this one that I carry across the shoulders. Sometimes I carry it like this, but always with that awareness to move from shoulder to shoulder, from side to side. When it comes to men bags, it's the same thing. So this is a very common men bag um, of guys. And it's exactly the same thing. Um, have something that allows you to carry it in different ways. Like this, or like this, or across. But always reminding yourself to change from side to side. And not create that repetitive pattern. This is all that I have to say about having a shoulder lower than the other. 
as a summary, use more of your known predominant side. Carry your handbag, your shopping on the side that uh, um, you're not used to. Always change inside from one side to the other, but of course use more that side that the shoulder is not so lower. And like that you are going to start correcting um, that uh, shoulder being lower. Is this going to fix your sh shoulders? Is this going to level up your shoulders? Well, it might not do it. 100% because we have been there for how many years? 10, 15, 20 years. So it's not in one year, two years that is going to level up the shoulders. But what this does, the new habits that you start implementing, what this will do is that it doesn't make it worse. So you don't want to carry on going down and down, down on that side. So level up or make it better by creating new habits. Hold your weight, the shopping, the, hand, the handbags more on the other side. I hope this is of great value to you. And if it is, please share this video around. And if you have any questions, let me know. Put them below and I'll answer them. And I'll be back with more tips. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye now.